I really, there's something wrong with me that I'm afraid when somebody comes up and puts me in a chokehold at 3 o'clock in the morning. I should go see a psychiatrist about that phobia that I have. You know? Every guy would love to be an ass kicker, you know? Every guy would love to beat the balls off a lot of people, you know? That's why ultimate fighting boxing is so popular. But let's face it, ultimate fighting and boxing are both phony. And I'll say it to B Hop's face right after the show. That son of a bitch. No, but uh, Hopkins is fight next week. Anyway, you don't have to worry. That's what the ultimate fighting for boxing. And, uh, you see, I, uh, no. But every. Here's why it is phony. Because there's always two tough guys fighting. You know, in boxing, ultimate fighting. Guess what? Every fight I've been in or seen, it's never two tough guys. It's one tough guy and one drunk guy who's making the sake of his life and is about to get the shit kicked out of him. I want to see that on TV. That's a show. Look at the announcer. In this corner, the bouncer at six feet six, 300 pounds, wearing some kind of karate pants with tie riding on the side. A t shirt is too small for him with the gym's name in it. You know? And in this corner at 5'7, 143, soaking. Wet. He's wearing his brother's new fringe jacket that he wasn't supposed to take when he grabbed his mother's in the shower and he only gets <laughs>